Finally, I want to thank all of you for the efforts you're making towards green technologies. I have traveled around the world to many places, usually at your expense. I've been to the North Pole, I've been to the Antarctic, I've been to uh, Greenland, I've been in places. I know that climate change is real. I know that it's real. We can have a debate as to how serious it is, but the debate about climate change is over. And I believe that the way we're going to succeed in addressing this and preventing even further damage to our planet is people like you. Because I believe that it's going to be technology that's going to get us through this very difficult period as greenhouse gas emissions continue to increase and further damage is done to our planet. I believe that we need to do a cap and trade proposal, which Joe Lieberman and I have proposed for several years. One company reduces greenhouse gas emissions, they earn a credit, they can sell it to another co uh, company. I'm, I'm sure you know it's being employed in Europe now. I also believe fervently in nuclear power. The French now generate 80% of their power with nuclear, uh, their electricity is generated by nuclear power. We all try to imitate the French at all times, as we know. <laughs> Uh, by the way, I, I, on my way back from my last trip to Iraq, which I know we'll talk later, I, we stopped and saw the new president of France, and I'm happy to tell you he is pro-American, which proves if you live long enough, anything is possible. <laughs> and, uh, according to my calculations, he's the first pro-American since Lafayette, but I may be wrong in that, may be wrong in that assessment. But um, we, we, um, we must address... The issue of climate change, it has a lot to do with the future of our planet, future generations of Americans, and, there, and, I, and I believe that the greatest nation in the world, with the smartest people in the world, with the most innovation in the world, that we can develop the technologies which will green, uh, reduce greenhouse gas emissions and save this planet for future generations of Americans.